New cries for justice tonight from the family of a black man killed by a former state patrol trooper. A grand jury failed to indict the former trooper despite his arrest last summer. CBS 46's Mary Smith tells us what Lewis's family and their attorneys are now demanding. Yes, I did have a very, very rough night last night. The family of 60 year old Julian Lewis, who was shot and killed by a state patrol trooper on August 7th, is demanding justice once again. A Screven County grand jury did not indict Jacob Thompson. The former trooper was fired a week after the shooting and charged with felony murder and aggravated assault. But now the family once again faced the cameras demanding answers. We believe that this was a very strong case. The evidence was there. And still is. Justice um, was not what we experienced on yesterday. And we're committed. And it is it's our hope that the rest of the country sees this, what has happened here. Thompson said he was trying to pull Lewis over for a broken taillight. GBI says Lewis refused to stop, leading Thompson on a short chase. Using a pit maneuver, Thompson stopped Lewis's vehicle in a ditch. Thompson shot Lewis once, killing him. A GBI investigation revealed Thompson lied several times about the facts of the incident, including perceived threats from Lewis and why he used deadly force. It's time that a U.S. attorney step forward and review this and prosecute this crime. His family and their attorneys are now demanding any video evidence to be released, the district attorney to pursue the case further, and another grand jury to look at the evidence. I feel like if he took my son away from me, we need some justice there on this. He needs to do some time or something for taking my child's life. In Atlanta, Mary Smith, CBS 46 News.